hello and welcome back to my channel if this is your first time passing by thank you so much and if you are already watching my video before thank you so much for supporting my channel so this video i'm going to be teaching you how to make a pizza cut and i'm going to teach you how to sew a perfect wig how to close a pizza cut and then how to cut your hair so guys forget about the length of the video because everything in this video is for you i made this video for you if i tell you the length of this video that i've been able to edit this video to this minute guys you're going to open your mouth i love you so much and i just don't want you to spend so much bundle so i was able to edit a video of 132 minutes to 90 minutes oh guys i love you so much so guys don't leave this video because of my poor camera guys because everything is in this video is important if you miss any part of this video then you're going to miss your outcome because pizza cut is is such a way that you need to follow a step and if you miss any step you're not going to get the result that you want and guys this is not why you came to this video you want to make your own wig that is why you are watching this video so please do not skip this video because of the length of the video because in the long run you are going to benefit and guys please i spent so much days making this video because i wasn't well and but right now i am perfect i am okay thank you so much for your prayers and i really appreciate it so in this video i'm going to be doing less talking because the video is very lengthy and the video does not require much talking because i really don't know what to explain so what we are what you are supposed to do right now is to pay attention to the video and i'm going to be explaining where it's necessary i might be writing something down so you need to pay attention to this video guys so mostly when i'm starting my pizza cut i start at the tip of the lace and guys please do not sew through the elastic band this is going to prevent the elastic band from moving do not sew through the elastic band so just look at what i'm doing in the video and do same to your wig and do not forget that when you put the wig up on the mannequin head you have to stretch the wake up this is going to help fit the individual's head without even measuring the head of the client so do not forget to always stretch your wake up when you fix it on the head i also double my thread i double my thread when i'm sewing my wig any wig at all this is to help secure the wig yes because i don't want a situation that in the future the thread is going to tear or something so i double the thread so in all i'll be getting about four pieces of thread So anytime I finish sewing, I tie a knot just to secure my thread, just to secure my thread. So I tie a knot and then cut the remaining thread and then the hair. So 
so when you are sewing a pizzy cut make sure the spacing is very close to each other this is going to give you a nice outlook when you finish whenever you are starting a new hair make sure you secure it enough lock it very well because the starting point is very very important I always start my pizza cards from the left to the right this makes it easy for me to sew my wig so guys I'm going to speed the video and I'm going to skip some part of the video because if I bring everything here we are not going to leave this video yet I'm going to double the hair for the front part I don't know why but I just want the front to be a little bit thicker than the back So when I get to the back where I've drawn the lines, I'm going to double the hair. You can double it twice or you can double it triple. Yes, this is going to help raise the back of the hair. Mostly people prefer the hair, the back of the hair raised. So I'm going to be doubling that part either twice or thrice.
So, if you like this video so far, do not forget to give me a thumbs up, share this video, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe for me. Thank you so much. So we are almost closing our hair and I doubled the hair to close the wig to close the wig
you so much for watching this video and i'm going to see you in my next video bye bye